Good morning from Galveston, Texas today. We are here for Dickens on the Strand. We took you guys here last year, but we made a mistake. I made a mistake. I looked at the website and it said 10 o'clock, but that was last year's time. This year's time is 12 o'clock. So we're here early, so we're gonna go eat at the Mosquito Cafe because it's one of our favorite places to eat breakfast in Galveston. <laughs> we're in full Dickens garb here and we're gonna go eat breakfast. Corned beef hash tacos and some cheesy grits and a mango nectar mimosa. They also have bakery treats. These are baked at patty cakes across the street. By the way, they also have it upstairs. Never knew this was here. There's upstairs dining, downstairs outside dining. There's also an indoor room upstairs, but there they have the air conditioning on. It was too cold. So there's the outside. I'm gonna go back inside. I got the mango mimosa. That's a nice mimosa. Looking nice. Thank you, Sonia. Yeah, thank you. All right, there's our cheesy grits. Oh, look at those corned beef hash tacos. Oh my gosh. And two over easy eggs. That looks so good. Mmm. The cheesy grits are good. I messed up my egg. I left half of them just plate. Ooh. Those are so good. Uh -oh. That's not good. Tacos are amazing. Finished eating breakfast and it was delicious. And then we searched for about 10 minutes for a good little parking place. We parked in one place, but it had a yellow paint on the sidewalk and that's a loading zone. So we decided let's be safe. Let's park in a white zone. Took a minute to find a spot though, but we did. If you come in costume, in garb, they give you half off the price at the gate. So whereas normally it'll be 15, should be 750 or around eight bucks today. Right, this is the Galveston port where the cruise ships leave from. And Disney has two cruise boats that, that leave from here, but they are, only was it october november and december i think, so, I think yeah. so yeah it's only certain times of the year but we're gonna go on a cruise next year disney in november from here so i'm really looking forward to that now that i know we're doing that and i can see this this harbor over here it makes me excited <laughs> see there's one of the cruise ships right there look at that water slide man a couple of them that's a big boat look at our shadows Shadows look very cool. My skirt looks really, I look really tall. Oh, there you go. 15 Saturday and Sunday, youth $9. See, discounted $8 for adults if you're dressed up like you are. Just waiting for the booth to open at 12 so we can get some tickets. Yay, finally getting to go. Thank you. We only made it in. We were like in line for 40 minutes. Oh, hey! She said, y'all look amazing. Come get a free photo. You might have to do that. Everybody, wants to say hello. Everybody needs to adopt her. Hi, Tessa. Oh, sweet girl. Get a big yawn. Yeah, we need it. We need this a third puppet. Best. There were 11 in the oh, letter, so they're 11. all named after presidents or first wives. Can you imagine? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's... What is that one's name? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Leave, Moose antlers. Let's get him a Christmas present. Tomahawks. What's that? Moose knuckles? That's a giant bone. 
Oh, there's mead? Oh, yeah, it's good. Black fair meadery. Oh, no. Black currant mango. That one is fantastic, and the mango lime is also really good. I'll try the, the black uh, currant mango. Mama, mama, mama. Hey, how's that mean? Morning. <laughs> Get that. You're gonna have a pita. They have everything: burritos, pitas, wraps, little puppy ornaments, uh -oh. and scary vampires. vampires. Yes. Some masks here. Ooh, that one's cool. Oh, that's scary. It'd be kind of hard to. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love this one. That's pretty. That one and that one. Wow, look at that. Chicken and steak pita. There's a steak pita. It's alpaca hair balls. They're hair balls. <laughs> but I don't want to use like the dryer sheets anymore. They won't like you need these. Oh, so smart. So it takes out like the static cleaning. The static and yeah, and it that keeps it all natural and helps expedite your drying process. And you can use that over and over too. Over and over and over. Can I you also put like essential oils, oils in it too? Yeah, most people do that. So they actually take little pictures of the alpaca that they used for their fibers. Look at this. So each one has a name. Like this one came from Melody. This one came from Milrabella. So you can see who who donated their fur. This is so neat. We are Rancho Inca alpacas. You see, it? same hands, girl, same hands. <laughs> <laughs> like that's you, that's you that's right me, there. That's right there. So we bur it. we bur them all, and so we have the family tree. That was awesome. The uh, alpaca guy was telling me all about his little alpacas and the way they feed them and play with them and love on them. That's pretty neat. I really kind of want some of those alpaca gloves, but they have the little mitts that go around them. I may have to get some of those. Those are precious and super soft. He's playing the glasses. Basically, G major, this G major put together okay. with all the notes of those scales. That's so you can make nice chords or all the, yeah, the notes gorgeous. are close together so you can make nice right. big chords. That's what I used to do with my kids, make, make it harder for them to mess up. There you go. have a C sharp for that, which I don't have. Right. It's a great way to show you what the water does. This is all yeah. water tuned. It's not just the size of the glass, although that does play a role. Okay. The glass is also water tuned. In this case, I want a C sharp. I'll take my C natural, take my strange looking tuning device right here. <laughs> parents might recognize. That's a C. <laughs> take some water out and listen to what happens. I'm going to raise that, that note half a step. By taking water out, you can raise the pitch. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. hey, how do you know exactly how much to take this for? Every glass is different, but I know yeah. that one pretty well. I don't, I know I couldn't do that. I would fall down. Captain Jack's here. Captain Jack is always here. It's Galveston. Oh, look at this. This is precious. A sea urchin, a street urchin, he's a little street urchin. Penny for the song cover? Penny for the song cover? <laughs> oh look, she's a Christmas tree. Wow, that's cool. And she has a little elf. 
Yeah, it's neat. Log, hot spiced wine. Not cold enough. Okay, no, it's 74 degrees. Fezzy Wigs pub, little outdoor pub. There's some handmade soaps and stuff. Hello. Hello. Come back and smell that. Oh, turkey leg. You got all the people you can beat with that? Oh, wait, it unscrews. What does it do? Oh, really? <laughs> so, as with any festival, there's going to be a first aid station. This one is over here. We actually had our friend Jessica that just went in here because she accidentally got cut with her knife in her pouch. Oh my, pizza pie. Oh, wow. Wait, maple syrup and cream cheese? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, precious baby. Hey, look, Bob Crutchin and Tiny Tim. And old Ebenezer. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, wow. Her poor little dirty feet. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. It's crazy. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> So this shop is always Christmas, by the way. It's beautiful stuff. Keeper Skills Village. Oh, it's the chair things. Oh my gosh. Oh man, these are amazing. We sat in these last year, y'all. I I wish I could afford one of these because they're amazing. It's the third one down, the Santa Cruz. Santa Cruz? That's not bad at all. If you order now, if you order later. Hey. Made my hammers, my tongs, and everything out in front there. I can punch all the way through. Oh, it's a so trivet. You get a pile of nails right there. We're taking those nails and I'm turning them into those little hearts. So here, I've taken that nail and necked it down here and drawn it out. And now it's getting shaped into a little heart. It's actually drawn from one, two, three, four, the fourth clip hole. Oh, you, you made it that wide? You lined it? Oh, yeah, absolutely. That's so cool. You didn't have a blacksmith, you didn't have a town. Nope. They made, uh, you know, the barber's Everything. razors. Yep. Right? They the made, horseshoes. Uh, the tailor's needles. It'll season up just like cast iron, but okay. it doesn't taste your food like cast iron because it's just carbon steel. I'm leaving here tomorrow. I like that. <laughs> You gaining knowledge? This is how yes. I do everything at home too. Everything is by hand crank forge and by hand hammer. So you want a little bit of smoke without fire, and look, you can just see it oh absorb. Oh wow! Look yeah. It just spreads right into the surface of the steel, and it dries right just up, like just it like oil. that. So it's like that before you oil. I never knew they waxed it. Or... So the waxing adds just enough um, rust protection for something that you're going to handle regularly. And her skirt, I love her skirt, I love her skirt, thank you guys. There are some beautiful pieces in that shop. It was really hard not to do this. Getting ready for the parade, lined up on both sides of the street. Give me a British flag. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. That's the ship that our friend Jessica works on. Look at him go! Look at him go! Oh no, there it goes! There it goes! Yeah. 
That's awesome. <laughs> pretty like a princess. Go you look so pretty, Lola. How are you? And look at mom. You got your mom looks fries? amazing. Look how gorgeous everybody looks. Everybody's dressed so beautiful. Oh yeah, that coat and tails. Get those ringlets. Looks amazing. <laughs> so this is my friend Whitney in the middle, right here. This is my friend Whitney and her daughter Lola. Uh, her husband Eric and JC, their little boy. I am totally in love with like her whole outfit right here. That is so like rose on the Titanic. Yeah, it's a roasted chestnut. Yeah. So take that off. Roasted chestnut. Thank you. That was sweet of you. I've never had an actual so rosy chestnut. A buttery texture, not a lot of taste. And some people put salt on it. Yeah. I don't know. But if you like salty nuts, but it's really very like buttery texture. Oh, it's nice and hot. Yeah. Is it like a bro how to describe it? It's like a potato. Oh, like it's, it's more of a potato. It's really yeah. sweet. Oh, oh my! Oh, yeah. But they have to be roasted well done, like a baked potato. Those are delicious. We gotta find an AGM because those are good. Those are so good. It's like a buttery potato. Okay, that was really, really nice of them. They gave us one chestnut to try because we'd never had one. That was really nice of them. We're gonna go try to find the ATM so we can go get some to take home because they taste like butter. Sweet potatoes. They're amazing. Okay, so Jeff and I decided to take one more detour into the old Tommy photo shop because Buster's gave us a ticket to get a free photo. So we're going to get our photo taken while we're in outfits like this and uh, hopefully get us an 8x10. I think it'd be nice to put on the other side of our other 8x10 with uh, Jeff's mom and dad that we got. I guess two years ago, maybe? That's the last thing we're gonna do, and then we're gonna head home tonight. That is about the cutest little girl ever. Look at her. Look at her. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's our turn next. We're gonna get to finally, we're gonna finally get to go. Get some pictures. Yankee, what we got done. We are fine. New pictures for our adventure wall. Yay. Well, we kind of missed it. Look. So they ra they race in beds. They push them down the street and they race the the beds. <laughs> All right, guys, that was a day. We had a really good time at Dickens on the Strand. Spent all day there. Got some really cute photos done. We really really liked them. They were fun. And their first one was free. We only paid for the two five by sevens. So that was kind of cool. They're like, hey, you guys look good. Come in, get a photo. That was a but it was like an hour and a half to do that. We're gonna go home now. We're tired. <laughs> We had Disney, we had one day off, and then we had Dickens all day today, so we're done. And remember, seven stops make the best adventures. adventures.